In this video, we'll draw the graph for y equals 4x. And we're going to do it two ways. First, we'll put values in for x here and get the corresponding y value. And that'll give us points that we can graph and find the line for y equals 4x. Then we'll check our work with the slope-intercept formula. So let's start, put some values in for x here. I like to start with 0. It's a good place to start because 0 will be on our graph here. 4 times 0, that gives us 0. How about we put 1 in for x? 4 times 1 is 4. And if we put negative 1, 4 times negative 1 is negative 4. So these are the values that we'll graph for the linear equation y equals 4x. Let's start off with x is 0 and y is 0. So here's x is 0 right here, and it's also y is 0. So that's our first point. Now we can do x is 1 and y is 4. So 1, 2, 3, 4. And then x is negative 1. We have negative 4 for y. So negative 1 and then down. 1, 2, 3, 4. So you can see we could just put a line through this, put some arrows out here, show it goes to infinity. And this is the equation. This is the graph for y equals 4x. Let's use the slope-intercept formula now. Check our work. So we have y equals mx plus b. And there's our m, that's 4, but we don't have a b. So we can just assume b is 0. That doesn't change the equation. So if b is 0, our y-intercept is 0, we go to the y-axis and we find 0. That's where our line should cross, and there it is. So that's our y-intercept. For the slope, we have 4, but it's helpful to think of this as 4 over 1. It's still 4, but now we can say rise over run. So we're going to go up 1, 2, 3, 4, and over 1, rise over run. We go to our y-intercept here. We go up 1, 2, 3, 4, and over 1. So there's our point. Let's do it again. 1, 2, 3, 4, and over 1. Likewise, we can go in the opposite direction. We could go down 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, and over 1 in the opposite direction. Let's do it again. 1, 2, 3, 4, and then over 1. So this is the graph for y equals 4x. We've done it by plugging points in and graphing them. And then we've checked our work with the slope-intercept formula. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.